guys, it's your girl Shanae, no Dante. So guys, I already did my, like this intro was actually going up after I did the video. So that's why like my hair is already done and everything. But um, so today I'm going to be doing my hair routine in this video. I wanted to do this because I felt like, I don't know, I feel like it was just needed on this channel. So before I get started, make sure you subscribe, click the notification bells, and like this video because I do see that 70% of you guys have not subscribed, and that means 70%? Wow, that's disappointing. But 29% of you guys are subscribed, so thank you to those 29 people who are. I love you. So let's get right onto this video. Also, guys, my back is all wet, but here is my hair without the twist in it. Here is all out. Um, obviously, my hair looks really short right now, but when I blow dry it and um, get it all out and dry it, it will look much better. But here it is, a little 360 for you guys. It looks super weird. Um, but um, yeah, so here it is. It's really soft, I love it. This is perfect. <laughs> Okay guys, so firstly in this video, I want to be doing my hair. I'm gonna do like all the other stuff later. So I have a bunch of like set up behind this camera that you guys can't even see. So first I'm going to take my headband off. I just had it um, just to like make me look better today so I don't look like really a mess today. So I'm gonna like pull these little braids out, these little pom poms, and I'm gonna take them out. And then, um, yeah, so we're gonna take, we'll just do one of them on camera. So we're gonna take it out. We did wrap these a lot, so um, I'll, we're gonna take this out. <laughs> okay, it's out. So we got like rubber bands here. Um, we did it last night, just a little bit to make it feel better. So we're just gonna pull one out on camera. We're gonna leave this side for um, after we blow dry this side. So it's a little damp still, so that's pretty good for me. I like it a little bit damp. And then, so here's my hair. Looks super short right now, don't mind. But, oh my God, it smells so amazing. I love the smell of this shampoo and conditioner I use. So um, here it is, really soft, really nice. Um, so now we're gonna get, um, a comb. We have two of them. I actually bought three just in case if I needed another one. So I bought a purple one, a very like thinnish one, and then I bought another one. So I'm gonna use this one. And what I do is I part it. So I'll grab from here and I'll just go down and I part it right down the middle. Or not really in the middle. That's like, I just do sections at a time. And then we're gonna grab one of these. I also brought um, really big like rubber bands basically and I'm just gonna like get this in the back and just keep it in the back for now just a little section right there and we have this little section here and I'm gonna grab a comb the wide tooth one basically <laughs> and we're just gonna comb it through not hard at all there it is up close we just have a little really really soft I really like it because since my mom would also help me blow dry my hair I wanted to do it today I do like half of my hair that you taught me the other half because my hands get really tired so we're gonna keep brushing through and that's done so we're going with the fine tooth comb one and this one it gets like all the knots the bigger one doesn't really so that means my hair is actually really soft because usually you would have a lot of knots still but it doesn't so oh my god yeah I do have a knot right there um yeah so I'm doing this and then we'll get back to you guys when I'm gonna blow dry it. Okay, so <laughs> the blow dryer I use is this one right here. It's gonna fall out the box. The box is open right here. But I use this one. Um, there it is. It's the yellow bird one right here. <laughs> um, yeah, so I use this one. The only complaint I have about this is that it doesn't have like rubber right here. At this part, we, like you hold it, you can hold it here, but it's really hard to do it while you're holding it right here. So I usually hold it right here, and it burns like it's really hot. So um, it's really hard to do that. Okay, so I plugged it in over there, and I have to tell you, I'm not in my downstairs bathroom. I'm in the upstairs bathroom, so it looks a little bit different. We got some butterflies going on back there. Um, so now on top of the little blow dryer. Um, we have this little comb, and we're gonna put it on top, and this helps comb out my hair while I'm blow drying. So, like, if you have my kind of hair, it'd be good for to like use this and blow dry it and everything. So, um, a lot of stuff are falling right now. <laughs> so yeah. So here it is. I hold it right here. I try to go as like far as I can up to the top. 
because if I hold it here, my hands are gonna burn off and turn super red. But usually I have to touch the burn part because it's really hard not to. So now we're gonna go ahead and start it. This is my little section. I usually go one more time with combing it out just to make sure there's no more knots. Like, yes, of course, I have another knot. Like, they come like every five seconds. So I can make sure I brush it out. Um, it would look really like hard to comb on camera, but it's like, in real life, it's the most softest thing and it smells amazing. So yeah, we comb that out and now it's time to turn it on. So just press this button right here. Oh, that was a fail. I think I press this. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what that was about. That was a little awkward on camera. That never happened to me before. So it looked like I have to press this reset button on the little outlet part. I don't know what that was about. So now we're gonna go ahead and flip down the switch. Off is up and then on is down. So ready? There you go. I wanna make sure it's hot. So it's hot, so that's perfect. So um, now we're gonna go ahead and blow dry it. Let's go ahead. Flip that. Turn this a little bit, already hot. Grab a piece. And slowly start down from the bottom to top. I'm talking louder. I don't know if you guys can hear me or not, but I go from bottom to top. single part again while it's all out so here it is looking pretty slick looking pretty shiny so now we're gonna go ahead and do it one more time and then I guess I'll do this whole side and then come off camera and then come back on and then show you so come again get another part I will actually sometimes just like twist not twist maybe I'll twist it I'll twist it so I'll twist it I'll just go like so this part is getting in it to go like so and we'll just twist it um, just to keep it softer and so it doesn't get in the other part while I'm trying to blow that, um, blow out that part in the back. So we'll just twist it up. Like so, not cute, but that's what it is. And then we're gonna go ahead with this comb. And not trying to get this front part, I should actually do the back to front. It would be way better, but that's fine. Um, so we look at the top and then we'll grab a little part here. This kind of hurts, not gonna lie. But we just gotta do what we gotta do. Okay? We got another section. You should won't even go in sections if it takes a long time. But today I have time to do it. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, we're gonna grab this back part again. Co frame and frame, I don't know. Grab this back part and just leave it hanging. And then we got this part again. Now I'll just do it one more time on camera and then I'll come back and do it again. So we're just gonna comb it out. Pretty hard, not gonna lie, kinda hurts a little bit, but sounds really like <laughs> disturbing, I don't even know why, it sounds really bad. Okay, and then go like this, comb it out. Okay, and then now it's time to use the thinner comb, and this, I can tell this part's gonna have a lot of like knots in it, because I can already feel it. Um, yep, of course, didn't even get to the top yet. That's terrible. Okay, poof ball going on here. And as I said before, <laughs> we're gonna get the castor oil and get a little bit on our finger. Put it on our hand. Wipe up in our hand, smoosh around. Don't get it on my scalp. Make sure I'm not getting this back part. I'll probably fix that back part so it's not poofy. Okay, rub it all in there. Get the ends, cause my ends are really bad. I have really split ends and it's really bad. Okay, get all up in there. We're gonna fix this back part because it's really hard since it's still poofy. We're gonna bring it more to this side. Um, and we're gonna try to like put it in a bun like so it's gonna get anywhere like this. Okay, and then go over with the big comb, white comb again. 
See, it gets hard. I don't know why. It's so hard to do this. I need my mom's help. Oh my gosh. She makes it way easier and faster. Okay? Finish that. And usually I don't even have to brush it out like all the way because then it will, you know, this will help it a lot. And it's already hot right here. And I usually give it a little time. I try to take long on this so it can cool down so I can hold it. Okay, switch the button. Let's do this part. up this side and then we'll come back on this side when it's done so see you there okie dokie once again we finished this side just finished it not even two seconds ago and we just finished it awesomely long i really love it oh my gosh it's kind of still hot so we're gonna take out this side i kind of fixed it i kind of just put a little knot over it while i was gone and then um pull these out take these out i just figured to do this whole piece I was not going to do the whole piece though, like in one, because that's a lot for me to do and my hands are really small and tired right now. And now, oh my god, look at those curls. They already have your curls. So, now we're going to comb these out. Okay, so here is my hair. Um, we can probably tip the camera down a little bit for you guys. Here's my hair. There it is, after it is all done and combed out we try to get between these areas just in case if i missed it look how much hair i have just on one side that's a lot for me i mean i mean it's like really long too my hair got super long i've seen the growth um as i've been using that castor oil too sometimes um because i mean they say you can also use castor oil on your eyelashes and your eyebrows and i put them on my eyebrows sometimes and my eyebrows to me look fuller. I mean, I always had full eyebrows, but cash oil is the way to go. It's really, it's really good. So, yeah, I just use a big um, comb for this time. I don't want to use like the small one because it's really hard. I kind of feel a little knot down here. It's like a little hard. I feel like I didn't get that part as well. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna do this part. Just like two scoops too. Yeah, I didn't get that part really. Missed it a little bit. Okay, we're gonna put that down. Yeah, now it's better. It feels a lot better. We're gonna put a little bit of castor oil on the ends because they feel a little dry right here at the end. Look how beautiful it is. It's so shiny. Oh my gosh. This is a lot of hair for me. And then, so to keep it soft and to keep it not just out, I'm going to grab it. We're gonna part it in three parts and we are going to basically braid it and we're not going to leave it braided we're going to take it back out and do it all again um so we're going to grab it grab this back part a lot of hair for me grab it we're going to look like wendy's for a quick second <laughs> wendy's girl and then we're just going to do this <laughs> Just a little bit, and then twist to the ends. I'm not gonna make it like tight or anything, so here it is. Let's give a little 360 again, and then we're gonna go ahead and do this side. So we'll be right back. All right, you guys. Oh, and do y'all know what that was? That lighting was a little, a lot. Um, so actually, it's a little bit blurry. I don't know what's going on there. Um, so here's my hair. Just finished it. <laughs> Um, I took out this part and I just wanted to speed up the process a little bit so you guys are not sitting here watching me take so long on my hair but since I have a lot of hair it takes a lot of time so here it is super soft another 360 here's it from the back um, yeah so here's all my hair you guys now know what it looks like out <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna go a little bit just a tiny tiny bit of it this side took way shorter time because this one I patted in like three spaces I did this in half and it went from back to front instead of front to back because back to front was way easier. 
This is hot, really hot. Okay, so now it is time to do this. I don't know if it's blurry or not. It looks like it's blurry, but okay. We're just gonna go through this everywhere. to first get maybe the big comb maybe the big comb we're not gonna do the small one and what I do is I just comb it up get all the sides that I probably missed I'm just gonna comb it up in all one oh my god I feel like I'm messing it all up I feel so bad um but you know what it has to be done because I can't leave it out for more than 30 minutes or it's gonna get really like hard to comb out and I I don't know about that. So now we're going to, I'm looking in the mirror behind the camera. So if I'm looking up, I'm going to look at the mirror. So I brush it up, I get this, <laughs> and then I just have it on my hand, it probably go down. And then I'm going to get the thin comb, comb it up, and then try to hold it all up in one. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically braid at the top, pull it back out, and get it up back in one again, and then put it into a bun shaped. So that's gonna be my go-to today. I love this hairstyle. It's really easy. It's not in my face. Um, it doesn't bother me unless it's like really like tight and then like it hurts, makes me give a headache. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna hurry through this process because I don't want you guys waiting um, too long. So I guess we're gonna fast forward here. not the final product so now I'm going to get it up I'm gonna drag it down <laughs> and then I'm going to get three parts at the top one right here probably that's probably too big one right here right there and then another one and we're gonna split this in half like that we're gonna like drag it a little bit so make sure it's like tight and then I'm going to braid it Little interruption, sorry there's a lot of like mistaken words in this video. And now, let me scoot back, and now I'm bent down, we're gonna twist it up into the air because obviously at the end not all of them are like the same size I just tried to make it the same size but they're not all the same size so I twist it and then here it is 360 again uh, maybe we can put the camera up a little bit more and then maybe I'm going to try to find I don't even know where it disappears if there's one um, I'm going to get a rubber band I think it's a little unfocused I'm going to get a rubber band and then um, I'm gonna take this back out actually first oh my gosh what am I doing we're gonna take this out first try not to mess it up too much take it out bring it forward like so and then now we are going to just brush it up and then fix it by the way, this lighting is going in and out terribly. It's orange, it's not like the real lighting I have all the time, so it's gonna be pretty bad, but sorry for that. So now, it's time to brush it up. Just get all the sides, and I'm gonna put back on my headband I had. I don't even know where it went, but I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna put it back on my head, and since I'm wearing yellow today, it looks orange in the camera. Since I'm wearing yellow today, 
I'm gonna put back on my yellow headband. So that's what we're doing. So we're gonna brush it up, make sure it's at least as neat as possible. Super soft, super amazing. I usually should do my hair at least once a week. I'll probably go two sometimes, but that's kind of bad for my hair. But sometimes I just don't have the time, okay? I don't have the time. Okay, I'm gonna get the rubber band again. This is the final. Okay, we're gonna grab it up. Super soft, oh my God, I love my hair. My hair is so pretty. Super thick though. Like, literally thicker than a snicker. Okay, here's the side. Try to grab it up as tight as possible to make sure I get all the sides that are puffy. I try as much as I can. Like, this, you guys probably know, this is like my go-to hair style mostly every video. It's easy. It fits me, to me at least, it fits me, and then, yeah, so. Just wrap it around my, I'm super, I'm actually sweating. It's like kind of hot in this bathroom. Okay. We're trying to go one more time. It's really tight here, but one more time. Eee! Okay, I think I messed up a little bit, but that's fine, that's fine. Um, okay. So I was supposed to actually fit the bun inside. I kind of messed up the bun. Uh, kind of. Okay. Um, my hair got a little messy, but that's fine. We just brush it up. If you guys think I want a better like routine of me doing my hair, and I'll actually desperately try to like do a real hairstyle. And then now what I'm gonna do, like this coming up a little, but what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna wrap it. Don't know which way I wanna wrap it. Usually I go like. No, we're gonna go this way, and this rubber band is terrible. Okay, look. We're gonna go this way, probably. And wrap it from the front to back. I'm trying to find the other rubber band. Let me find that. Okay, <clears throat> found it. So, we're gonna have this here. This stuck here. I'm gonna bring it around, as I said. Try to get it big right here. Okay, bring it around, bring it around. Until it gets to this side. Grab the rubber band, I have it here, super thin, you can't really see, but I have it right here. Grab it, the bun, and just put it over. Looks really weird, oh my gosh, but this is the bun I'm gonna be rocking today until I actually do my hair. Sometimes I'll even twist it or um, braid it, but today I'm just gonna do it fast because you guys have seen me do my hair for I don't know how long. A good while and then now let's try to find my headband my yellow one okay i have my yellow headband and now we're gonna just do this try not to mess it up spread it around my head grab it make sure it's on the right side yeah it is okay and then fix it bring it up and this helps my hair a lot too bring this bring it back and guys here is the final product i can still feel like the heat in my hair for some reason maybe it's just because it's hot in this bathroom but now yep here's my hair 360 um yeah so little bun on top really deformed but that's fine okay hairstyle finished all right you guys so i'm in the same place i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you like subscribe and turn on post notifications but wait 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 i'm gonna give you three seconds to subscribe in three two one did you do it I don't really think so. If you didn't do it, get off the page. Anyway, I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Hey everyone! Click up there to watch your gender reveal. Click up here to watch something scary. Click down here to watch something crazy. And click down there to watch our mukbang. Bye! Bye.